Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this ceremony. Please make sure you switch off your mobile phones or any other sound device. We will be starting in a few minutes.
Ladies and gentlemen, please take your places. The color guard will now move into position. Ladies and gentlemen, the shape chief of staff, Admiral Joachim Rühle, <clears throat> the assistant chief of operations of the Finnish Defence Command, Commodore Jano Husko, and the Finnish PNMR, Colonel Peteri Kayanma, will now take their places. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this ceremony in honor of the accession of NATO to our latest member, the Republic of Finland. We are here today to mark this important occasion with the raising of the Finnish flag. Please stand to attention as the shape band plays the shape fanfare. Ladies and gentlemen, the Chief of Staff, Admiral Joachim Rühle, will now say a few words. Today is a good day. Today is a historic day. Today 
we will finally raise Finland's national flag here at JAPE headquarters for the first time and welcome them as our newest member. Finland is thus the 31st member to join the alliance after the fastest accession in NATO's modern history. While this marks the beginning of a new and exciting chapter for our alliance, the story of our collaboration with Finland began many years ago. NATO and Finland share common values and Finland's accession to NATO is the welcomed progression of a decades-long, intense and productive relationship. For years, we have very successfully and harmoniously worked side by side on operations and exercises and have exchanged thoughts and best practices. Finland has become one of NATO's most active partners and is and was a valued contributor to NATO-led operations and missions in the Balkans, Afghanistan and Iraq. These past years, we stood together as partners. But from today forward, we stand closer as allies. And how fitting that we are able to celebrate this historic day, this momentous occasion, today on the 4th of April, on NATO Day. Today marks the anniversary of the signing of NATO's founding document, the North Atlantic Treaty, or Treaty in 1949. For already 74 years, NATO has ensured the freedom and security of all allies, never losing its relevance, timeliness and adaptability. And we remain steadfast in our resolve to protect and defend our one billion citizens. to defend our territory and safeguard our freedom and democracy. Our ability to do that is now even stronger. Finland is stronger and safer within NATO. And NATO is stronger and safer with Finland as an ally. They are forceful and durable defense capability and resilience will strengthen our Nordic security and the collective defense of the alliance. So, as we raise Finland's flag, we know that we are better today than we were yesterday. Today is a historic day. Today is a good day. Ladies and gentlemen, the Finnish flag will now be officially raised. Please note that this will occur simultaneously at NATO headquarters, at Allied Command Transformation, and at several other ACHO headquarters. Admiral Rühle, Commodore Husko, and Colonel Kayanma, may I ask you to step down from the podium.
Congratulations to Finland. Ladies and gentlemen, the new national military representative to shape of the Republic of Finland, Colonel Peteri Kajanma, will now say some words. <laughs> Supreme Headquarters, Allied Powers Europe, Chief of Staff, Admiral Joachim Rühle, Finnish Defense Command Assistant Chief of Operations, Commodore Janne Husko, distinguished guests, generals, admirals, ladies and gentlemen, fellow soldiers. Finland has, has 
strong strategic importance as a NATO partner for almost three decades. We have been cooperated, consulted, and exercised our defense forces according to the NATO standards and with NATO members. Finland has participated to the NATO crisis management operations since 1996, and our commitment continues today in K4 and NMI. The unjustified attack against Ukraine has made long-lasting changes to the Europe's security environment. It has become very clear that peace, security, and rules-based international order are something that we have to actively uphold and be prepared to protect. For Finland, war in Europe brought back echoes from our own history. We have not forgotten our past. That is one reason why Finland has supported Ukraine with versatile defense material and participated in training efforts. This support will continue as long as it is needed. Ladies and gentlemen, the historical decision of Finnish parliament to apply for the NATO membership and the rapid progress of the accession process would not have been possible without the brave and effective defensive fight of Ukrainian people and their armed forces. As we have been supported, Ukraine have all the NATO states supported Finland's journey towards membership. I sincerely thank all allies for your continuous support and especially all of you working here in shape. You have showed real comradeship and you have helped us all the possible ways. The next Finland will look to the West as our president said, Finland's NATO membership will not be complete without Sweden. We hope that Sweden will join us in the near future. Being a NATO ally, Finland will always be responsible for its own security. The first and most important task for the Finnish Defence Forces is the military defence of the nation. This is achieved by maintaining a strong national defence supported by citizens' determined will to defend the nation even in the circumstances where the outcome is uncertain. The membership in NATO opens a new era for the Finnish Defence Forces. The membership in a military alliance will impact the tasks of the Finnish Defence Forces because with membership we will also prepare to defend our allies. Even though our defence is well established, and relatively advanced, we still need to work hard for the integration process in coming years. Finland respects all the obligations and responsibilities that come with the accession to NATO. We are fully committed to the security of each and every ally. We will make NATO stronger. Distinguished friends, we hoisted the Finnish flag among the Allies' flags as a sign of the unity. In Finland, the unity has been the cornerstone of our success throughout our history. Now we join the strongest military ally in the world, and the unity will strengthen Finland's own security and the security and stability of the Baltic Sea region and Northern Europe. I salute you all. I end with words which Finnish frontline officer, later general, and one of the, our iconic citizens said after the Winter War, never again alone. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand to attention while the Shape Band plays the NATO hymn, followed directly by the Belgian national anthem.
Ladies and gentlemen, this concludes our ceremony. Please remain in place during the dismissal of the color guard and the departure of the official party.